Right, well, here we have today a BMW R1200RT uh, X uh, police machine, as you can tell by the, uh, the decals. The uh, machine is in an absolutely lovely condition for its age. Uh, major feature of these bikes is obviously owned by well, the government. They are intrinsically maintained regardless of cost, and therefore you also comes with a very, very comprehensive uh, service sheet from uh, which has been supplied by the government from the dealer that serviced the bike for them so you know they've always been very very well looked after can literally be serviced in every other month sometimes if somebody needs doing uh, they are very very well looked after the bikes these it's a perfect sort of touring machine but also would be ideal uh, for a sort of long distance commuter or even just as a second bike for a bit of fun they are a very very good all-round motorcycle Obviously one of the main benefits with the GS's, or sorry, the RT's, is that obviously you've got the shaft drive, uh, which is against, goes against the whole range uh, of the 1200's, from the RT's to the GS's to the RS's, they all come with the benefit of shaft drive. Obviously you've got the panniers there as well. They also come with uh, the rear unit, which is lockable, I haven't done this one so you can see inside. Um, and obviously then there's a rucksack built into the back for storage um, so very useful compartment for extra storage for carrying again just very good condition all around wheels exhaust all the paint work is very good obviously comes with the very excessive or extensive sorry uh, crash bars on there again normal for the local authorities uh, again just extra bit of width to put a bit of protection there so you've got the additional mirrors on there as well for safety you see an amount on the top if you wanted to put a sat nav on there but the bike also comes with a ramp mount uh, so you can stick a conventional sat nav on there so this bike comes with cruise control, info computer, traction control, power screen and heated grips. So a very, very high specification bike. Mileage wise, say just over 58,000 miles, 58,601 to be precise. bit of a crack in the, uh, the glass on the drug counter uh, but there's no ingress on that so it's not really watering Full details of the bike will be on our website, speedthrills.co.uk, or if you wanted any different, any additional information, please feel free to give us a call on extra 01392 211 246.